Good morning, guys. Welcome to show day. It's a show day. It's the last show day of this season. Unless we find some winter shows, if Lady's up to it. I don't know if she'll be, if Sophie's up to it. I don't know if she want to do winter shows. Winter shows are cool, but we've done them before. I got her mane. You cut her mane? Yeah. Oh! It looks so cute. Oh! Doesn't it look cute? Um, pulling makes it flatter. Like it just. Well, I don't care about the thickness. I want it shorter so the braids look good. So the braids look good. We care about the braids looking good today, Ladybug. Ah, oh, baby. And we gotta do your mane today for the first time. Well, second time. Look at that thing. Uh, oh. This might not be very even. Wow, see how Sophie did it? It did, it worked better than expected. Did you see that on TikTok? No. So she put elastics. Oh, well, I'm glad it worked out good. Yeah, I'd love See, to make look. it. It's kind of straight, except that piece and yeah. Wow. It's better than. Wow. You know what? So cute with short man. I know, but I wanted it for long, for okay. winter. For you winter. You always want long, long For man. winter, so yeah. she don't be cold. Gabby, get ready for a surprise. Are you braiding? No. Come on, you're gonna be finding it easy. Come over here and take a look. Oh no, did you cut it? Yes. Okay. You're still cutting it? Because it's not even at the top. Well, well if she cuts it anymore, it's going to be called roached because there's not a lot left. Yes. <laughs> I cut it short. I went to the bank machine to get money for this horse show so and we left about. Sophie alone in the barn with her horse and this is what happens. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah. Look at. You're braiding it. I mean that. This is professional braid level. Like yeah, when we went yeah. to Champs yeah, with good, Chino. You're gonna braid. But she braid. She braided like four braids, and then she cut it. So she braided first, and then she cut it. Me? No, the professional braider. Mm. So he wow. still has a cold. All right. Well, let's get going. What do you need? What do you need from me? <laughs> Length. <laughs> I think you should. It's um. There's like a dip down. there, a dip there. It's fine. I'm not making fun of Sophie. I'm making fun with her. No, just joking. I'm not laughing at Sophie. I'm laughing, I'm laughing with her. her. <laughs> Sophie, Gabby's laughing at her. All right. Um, and I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm a sarcastic, kidding kind of person. Here's the thing, Sophie. This is your horse. You're learning. You're doing everything yourself, and I'm proud of you. I so. really want to cut all this off for the show again. But like, I also don't want to because I want it to grow out. But don't she needs let it grow That's her, out isn't that her bridal path? I'm cutting her bridal path. Oh, so which part? You, this oh. needs to grow back. This is main. That needs to grow back. Oh, and that's because when we bought her, it was cut. It was shaved. Wow, actually, she is looking way more fluffy today. So uh, that's the thing. Like, right. Sophie needs to learn how to do everything on her own horse. Yeah. She's been taking care of her horses the way that she wants to take care of them. Like she likes to keep their tails short. She likes to keep their manes sh short. It's not my hey, dream. If you don't let me cut Willow with Honey's mane, I'm cutting someone's mane. <laughs> I know. Deal with it. <laughs> oh man. Anyway, that that happened while we were away. But anyway, we can braid it up and she'll be fine. I, I just, your mother's shepherd shepherd I just feel like when a horse doesn't have a long mane, their nose looks really odd and big and awkward. And she already has a Roman nose, which I like. But anyway, so. No, she looks like she has no mane. So, Gabby, what do you need? I'll get it for you. String. All right. Even when I hide it. Yeah, I know. It's hard. So, you know what, Gabby? Sophie has to do this year? Just to do a trace cut on Lady because there's no way Lady's gonna be able to handle. Oh my god, I've done that. I know, and now know. Sophie's turn to do it. I think Gabby was 13 when she did it. Have fun. I know you're gonna have to help. <laughs> Are we kidding? But I believe in Sophie, and it's it's a rite of passage. You have to do your own thing with your own horse, even if somebody else doesn't like it. No. And you know what's weird? Like my kids don't have a lot of criticism in their life. They don't. They were homeschooled most of their life. <laughs> Hurry up. Okay, let's get me it in. Just, Mom, it's really short and it goes so long. Oh no. So what are you thinking? You do it a different way next time? No, this way worked actually kind of good. So basically to get really nice professional braids or at least nice looking braids, you need to have really short hair. I think she knew I was coming. 
Oh. Why? Because we could see you through the window. Oh my god. Crazy. She's like, what is happening? All right, time to brush her tail. Yeah, do her bit her her tail. And also, oh, there we go. Turn that off. Oh, you don't want that? Well, let's get a little good look at the mane. Oh, it looks cute. Bad. You know, it's perfect actually. It's making her. I was teasing you. Yeah, just what she, every girl wants. <laughs> just what every girl wants, right, lady? <laughs> All right, so Gabby's gonna braid, and Sophie's gonna clean her tack. We have two hours till go time till we have to leave. Anyways, what I was saying before was that my kids were mostly homeschooled, and so they didn't get that like criticism, especially like grades four, five, six, seven, maybe eight still. Like that was middle school years are so hard, especially on girls, because kids are go through like a lot big, huge hormonal. Kids go through a huge hormonal change in those ages and they are brutal. They can be brutal. So my kids didn't get through that. So didn't go through that. So they have hardly any criticism ever. Like they, you guys know, like I talk about the hate online. My kids don't read that stuff. They don't pay attention to any of that. Like when they- When I do read it, I laugh. What? When I do read it, I laugh. Yeah, like they can see it for what it like. So it's not like, it doesn't affect them. So it's not like real to them. So when I tease them, and make fun of them like with and just be sarcastic and and they know I'm just teasing but it helps them like it helps them it's a healthy kind of criticism it is cold can't see my breath but my fingers are sure cold anyways I forgot that I have to let my pigs out still we're in this new journey with the pigs Sam and I keep saying like we need to build an area for the pigs but we have no ideas and obviously it's Time to like shut things down, not build things. But the pigs take so long to eat their breakfast that if we feed them outside and then the goats eat it. And if, so we have to leave them inside to eat. But then that means that we have to come down like half an hour later and let the pigs out, which sucks because like today I forgot. And it hurts my feelings when I see them snuggled in their bed like they think they're not going out like that's awful i do not know what he's chewing oh he's making his bed he's like i'm coming come on out you go don't worry i'm not leaving you in all day and this is where it gets hard too because if i open this door then the goats come in and that's annoying all right come on out you go, out you go, you get out or not. Like, why doesn't everybody just come on in? It's a little easier because she's better trained. Come on, baby. <laughs> I just love her. But it actually hurts me. Like it physically hurts me when I come and she looks so sad because she thinks she's staying in. Come on, get out there. I'm gonna fill up your water. Go, quick. Go, I told them you were better trained. Get. <laughs> Go, Posey. It is peaceful down here on the, in the goat area though. Just like that, lady's getting her feathers shaved off and couldn't care less. So that's good, Sophie. She's gonna be really good for you when you have to give her a trace cut. All right, we're gonna try Lady with a Blanket for the very first time. I doubt she ever Watch wore. Out, oh my God, Gabby, don't do it like that. Oh, jeez Louise. So anyways, we wanted to try Chino's old blanket on her. Her belly's hanging out. Her belly. Well, that's and Gabby's like, what, she's an 80, she's Chino size? Chino is long. I'm like, she's long too, she has a long back. This blanket, oh, there's a caterpillar. This blanket barely fits Chino. Just, does it fit her? She was too long. I feel like it fits her okay. What is this? So it's just an insulated rain sheet. Oh, that's not an insulated rain sheet. That's like a 200. It's like a full winter blanket. I just bring the cooler. No, I'm bringing it. It's not an insulated rain sheet. I'll show you an insulated rain sheet. Good girl, lady. Sorry about her just throwing it on you. Well, I have to throw it or else it's not getting on. But yeah, it fits her. Like, she's going to get a new one because she needs pink. But it might be really cool because it's it might be really windy. All right, well, that works. We don't think she's ever yeah, had a blanket. I'm not taking it off because I pulled it off from Just do it, Gabby. Hi, handsome. Hi. 
oh, so Gabby and I were just, we were all just reminiscing about like this whole horse journey and how amazing. Yeah, don't rip that blanket, Storm. Lady's like, what? I have to go outside in a blanket? It'll be embarrassing. I'll embarrass myself. Show everybody how pretty you look. <laughs> she's like, this is embarrassing. No, so she's like, give me the food. Well, all's good. <laughs> Whoa, Penny, let her eat. He's like, well, it's my turn to get That's so food. rude. Storm, go over there and protect Lady. All right, I said you go. Well, look, she's coming back to you because nobody will let her eat. That's so mean. That's so mean. Nobody will, your horse won't. And then Storm just pushed her off too. Well, Storm's like, come on, let's go. <laughs> yeah. We don't like Penny, he says. That was probably my most fun show prep video ever. Like that was show prep. It was fun. I love when we're all just hanging out in the barn and reminiscing like Storm was the best first horse ever. Like, are we all agreed? He was like, when he's in shape and he's you know, he just was the best horse, man. I got smart, you guys. I got my money. I got my camera bag that I love. And I have a blanket. I'm bringing this huge blanket, soft, fuzzy blanket, so that I can be warm. I also have mitts, and I brought an extra pair because I know people be wanting them. You got mitts? No. You want mitts? No. Are you sure? I got this. That coat doesn't even do up. It doesn't? No, it's broken. Yep. Yeah. Do we have the, okay. The you ready to roll, ladybug? She's like, can I go back? No, it doesn't. You should get another sweater. I have two sweaters. I have two sweaters on too. And, a, and I have three sweaters on. All right, this is Ladybug in her very first ever hey, sweater. Lady, she looks like a ladybug. She's she incredible. does look like a Ladybug. Oh my God, we could have used this. Could've put black, dots. black dots on it, but we've decided not to do the costume portion. Oh my God, you should have grabbed black too. We should have, it's yeah. over now though. It is cold, like really cold. All right, last piece to go in. And we are ready to roll, you guys. 1.57, I said we're gonna leave at 2 p.m. And we are, yeah, I said quarter to two to you guys so that you guys would be ready. Everything's in? Everything's in, get it, Sophie, help her. Bridal. All right, we are ready to rock and roll. Hey, oh, Lord help us. Let's go. It's embarrassing when your dad is your cheerleader. Let's go, I feel bad for the animals. It's only 2 p.m., we couldn't put them to bed. I don't know what time we're gonna get home. Hopefully it's gonna be early, cause let me tell ya, it's cold, I'm freezing. Sophie, do you need gloves? I have gloves. I mean, for your hands to keep no, warm? I hate gloves. All right, let's go, you guys. It's a glow up. Let's go, you guys, we're going to a horse show. We are here, and horse shows are all about hurry up, let's get here and wait. So I'm gonna braid at Lady's Forelock while the sun is out. She is, look, she looks like she laid down. Well, it's just the hair down. It's a good thing we put this blanket on her. Every horse here has one of these coolers on her, on them. She I, does not care about it. I know, she doesn't even care. Like, I'm sure she's never worn a blanket before and she couldn't care less. Her, she will kick you. I know, we forgot the ribbon. Sophie kept reminding me, bring a ribbon, bring a ribbon, I forgot. Why'd you tie it? I'm she is. She understands. Sophie took her for a walk when we got here, so she. Oh, look at it's kind of small. It just goes back. The withers are high. That it goes back. Is that what it is? Yeah. Like I'm stepping in horse poop. Not our horse's poop. That's kind of gross. This much. Watch. There's poop right, but you're standing. Ew. Oh well. I never step in juicy poop. You always do. Our poop is dry. Anyway, I'm gonna do her hair. Her forelock. It's covered in grass anyway so we're here and there's 50 more trips now wait what'd she say 30 more trips 30 more trips before sophie's division 30 30 more trips 30 more rides have to happen before sophie's she's like whoa why are you taking that off i'm cold now she's gonna groom you and then she'll put it back on okay 
Anyway, so this is what Sylvia was talking about before. So when she was a carriage horse, they got rid of all that. They shaved it all down. So Sophie wants it to be a part of her mane now. Not all of it. I mean, I yeah, you did cut up bridal path? Yeah. Oh, it's a tiny bridal path. Whoa. She's like, why are you bugging me? She's like, I hear a horse kicking in the, in the trailer. A lot of people have their horses in the trailer. It's actually not too, too, too cold. I'm literally a morning person, so I have all my energy in the morning. And by the time nighttime rolls around, I'm like, not that energetic. Sylvie, you are a morning person. You don't know it, maybe? Yeah, that's true. But Sophie, even like, she's a morning person for sure. All teenagers like to stay up late. Gabby? I don't like waking up early. Gabby is not a morning person. And you are a morning person. Look at her fake tail. Yeah, so cute. I like straight tails better than curly tails. I feel like more mares have curly tails. you want me to straighten it? Yeah, I would. It'd be so gorgeous. <laughs> I wanted to put product in there and like straighten it all out and make it gorgeous. Anyway, I did her forelock and it was easy. She's gonna be like, so cute with, with her mane. You know what, you know what's different for us with Lady? It's like, you know those horses like that the Amish ride with their buggies and they park them outside the grocery store and they just leave them sitting there. I like, don't even know if they tie them up. They do. do they? They just stand there, but they don't ever do anything wrong. Like they don't ever walk away. They don't ever make a mistake. They just stand there and they're so patient and they just wait. That's like Lady, <laughs> like obviously she's an Amish horse. Like. Like, so much crazy going on around her, and she would never do anything wrong. Like, she, I don't know, man, this horse is like a dream. So he's going up right now to warm up, and she's second in her division. So there are um, four more trips, I think, in the division that's going right now. So he already learned her course, and she's going to warm up, and then she's number two. So then we're gonna go up there, and we're gonna watch. So. Sophie has barely ever done a derby before, like hardly ever. There's like lots of like rollbacks and it's totally different. It's a lot different than a regular hunter course. Here they go and Lady's like, come on! See all these horses out here and they're like trotting along and Lady's out there, whoosh! <laughs> uh, anyways, hopefully that bodes well for her. It's fun, it's good for Lady and Sophie to get out and to do things, and it's a really long winter, so this is the last show before the winter. We might as well try and see how it goes. Don't you know that you're beautiful?